Well, howdy, 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 nearly senior citizen here. Greetings, boys and girls, and welcome to this more Minecraft large biomes with the oddest, strangest, and yet most cool landscape I have ever seen generated in what is supposed to be a normal world. Supposed to be, because hokey smokes, is it not? Okay, this is here, and this is where I'm trying to map out up above, I believe. Which means, when I go to expand that then, it's probably going to get destroyed then, isn't it? Well, let's... Because we take the map that we want to make bigger, which is this one. I hate doing that. And then, we take it and we add, like, paper to it. And that makes it bigger. Right? Which also erases everything on it. Yeah, meaning we have to start again. I, I keep hitting that and it, that part's driving me crazy. And so, even though I have to head up here. Uh, now, I should have a a shield but yeah somebody mentioned you could put the map up in that hand that is very cool I don't know who had told me this nor do I remember how long ago they told me I want to move up north enough that it's going to show me as something more than just a third down south blob but it's not doing it so we're going to head back this way because it's dark <clears throat> But I wish to thank you very much for coming along with me on this journey of exploration. As once again, these are relaxation series videos. <coughs> Excuse me. Where well, the idea is to just chill out, relax, as we play some Minecraft. In a very strange world here. In this particular case. Let's see. Oh, hokey smokes. That almost makes my brain hurt. <coughs> but that's alright. And, and my sincere apologies. My, I don't know why my voice box keeps getting all caught up. I also realize that my frame rate... <coughs> <coughs> my frame rate could be better if we reduce some of the... Uh, the graphical load. And while I, I love all you little guys, I love a higher stable frame rate as well. There we go. We're not all going to perish, little guys. I promise. Not all of you. Hey. Don't stare at me while I'm swinging a sword at you. Oh, the horrors. If I had a, a greater video card or some such like that, I could probably, you know, get more anima nomos and not worry about my frame rate tanking. But for now, it's fine. So I have to bring things down a little bit. Well, no. One of you, yes. Two of you, no. And as it is, I'm sorry, little guys. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Why? There we go. Oh. The horrors we must commit for our frame rates. There are so many of them that I've gotten out that i got to go take care of them now. No. No. Ah, no. Sorry, chickens. It wasn't my fault. It was the fault of these sheep. One gets to run free. One. 
Well, you see there's one down there already, so... Oh, that works. Yeah. I mean, for me, me it works. Well, I think the frame rate's doing better already, so... As much as I hate doing this on all my various worlds, because I've done it to more than one now. I mean, it's every single one of my my worlds here. God, there's still too many of you. Oh, I gotta go out and take care of the strays out there again. It's okay, though. I mean, I feel sad for them, but I'm not getting rid of all of them. This is no genocide here. Okay, these sheeps. There. One can run free. <gasps> One can run free. Not two. Okay. Uh... We got enough cows. In fact, we could probably, I hate to say it, after I've been murdering everything down there, is I think I should probably get some more cows because I need some more leather. So, let's do that then. Uh, don't need the hoe for a little bit. I don't want to harvest the entire thing, but I, mean, I might as well do some. I know it's silly to have that map up there like it is, but that's okay. It's not hurting anybody. <laughs> and that's a good thing. <coughs> good lord. Good, my fault. I guess I'm going to be harvesting eh, a lot of a lot of the fields here. I mean, what the heck? I mean, I know these one. Oh, was that carrots or just wheats? Just wheats. And then there's the other plants. Boy. Okay. This is this has actually been a pretty good harvest. So I guess I shouldn't complain about all this. This was worked out really well. I mean, again, I know I'm tearing down ones that are immature and still needing to grow and thus only getting seeds but in fact the very seeds that I had planted in the first place but that's all right these are tall enough right? Right. there's a lot of these ready that's a very good thing hope he smokes Oh. 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 Beauty. Okay. Uh, we'll plant some carrots and we'll plant some potatoes. So let's just. That's supposed to be wheat. We'll just plant carrots on the remainder of this side. Okay. Even though that was a potato. And over here, we'll just plant potatoes and not carrots. Because that makes sense, doesn't it? It might. It might. There is a possibility of a poisonous potato? I can't remember how you even... I've never used them before. So I don't know how you use them. It's, I can't say I feel sad. But I just don't know. Boy, you you know, I mean, I might as well, you know? Okay. I mean, I've gotten them all so far. Uh, I'll pick it up a bit. And there's plenty more where it came from, so I'm not too worried. Oh, okay, good. Did it, where did that piece go? Oh, there it is. 
Jeez. Jeez Louise, so to speak. Oh, come on. So to speak. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. And then... Bum, 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 bum. Okay. Doing good. Doing good. I mean, originally... My plan had been to, uh, oh, well, empty out one of those, where did those of the seats go? Okay, I thought I saw an, an extra floating cow out there, and that was wrong. It shouldn't have been there. Okay. Here, let's... Because, as stated, again, I need more cows for leather. Yeah. And then, after a time, I will come in and commit atrocities so that the frame rate doesn't tank entirely. And we will go from there. Alright, very good. Very, very good. I... Okay. You all looked very eldritch for a moment. I mean, I can have a few piggies. There we go. And then you get one too. In fact, you, you get a carrot and you get a carrot. There we go. Bingo. So let's go clear this out. One of them is these. That one? Or that one, I wanted to hollow out as sort of a, just a, a storage thing, or move up further and get one of those spots as a forward operating base, which would make make much more sense because it's further along the path instead of like just sideways to where I'm going. So I think that would be much better. I do also think I need to make more bread. That's for the carrots. I don't have any sort of enchanting area. Oh, hokey smokes. Okay, yeah, those cows need to hurry up and breed. So that's that's good because I really need the leather. Oh, bingo. But wait a minute. Might as well. Because there's so many. Do I have any? Do I have any? Do I have any coal? Okay, just just to keep it filled, and then I need to make torches. So let's grab more of that, and then wood, so I can get sticks. And then I can take the sticks and turn them into torches, which, I mean, I'll need more of because that's not... Oh, oh boy. Did you see how it was staying away from, from this square? Yeah, I don't know why or what happens, but occasionally there is a conflict with something somewhere where if I keep trying to put something into that square, it is going to flip to my normal desktop, and then I don't know what's going to happen to the recording. So, oh, I, I hate that, but what can you do? Um, let's put some of this stuff away still. And by some of it, I mean most of it, which is weird that we have to take... Um, we can just store raw food at room temperature for weeks or years. Oh, I thought I'd caught disease already. But that you can store raw chicken in a, in a chest at room temperature for years and then just slap it onto a fire and cook it and it, and it becomes edible. Okay, so I want to get up far enough that I'm actually onto this thing again. 
and I think I want to hollow something out but it's got to be far enough along that it's like advancement that is just amazing the way it's just cut off right there just like a butter knife Zoof. cut it off and threw the other half away but uh, and there is just so much I mean I cannot remember I went a little bit over in this direction the last time okay I'm finally up there so that's good Ooh. hi buddy yeah, all right. Glad to meet you too. Okay, so this is just a cool area. We're gonna take a quick run over in this direction as I try to figure out, I mean, do, I mean, a forward operating base is good. That way I don't just have to throw myself down somewhere and then hope that nothing attacks while I'm catching some Zs. And that's never good. And then being able to just store your stuff is good. And did I even see this stuff last time? I mean, there's torches. I must have seen it, but it doesn't ring a single bell in my head. But I need to see it again. Because, good lord. This is just amazing. And so, I'm being amazed. A deep pit of water. Just water, lava, again, just shaved off right there, and parts thrown away. And again, the same here. And this, I mean, this is, this, I mean, this is cool. It is cool beyond words. Uh, I mean, this is just procedural landscape generation at its best. I know I'm heading back. I'm sorry, map. That is just incredible. That is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, let's head back over this way. I am eventually going to work on that forward operating base. Oh, well, I'm not even fully past this full circle yet, am I? No, because there's the water. Oh. Yeah, because, you know, well, deserts naturally abut water, don't they? Still, I mean, it's cool. Okay, we're going to just head up. Okay, we're going to try not to fall into pits, of which I'm kind of worried. <clears throat> I was listening and watching a... Listening to and watching... I couldn't speak English all of a sudden. A good, golly, must smell like Captain Sparkles video. And he was talking about the latest snapshots that are coming up on the new, the new version of coming out. That is just incredible. Look how tall that is. But it's now there's like cracks in the earth as you're walking along. And if you fall in, and not like the ravines and stuff that they have right now. These are cracks in the earth. And if you fall in, generally you die. This is cool. Just trees over there? Oh, cactus. That's a desert. That is sugar. That's water. Okay. I'm all right. And, oh. I was going to say, and you can believe that, but then I noticed that. <laughs> oh my god. The incredible generation of landscape does not stop. I want to... Well, I'm going to have to 
hurt myself in this fashion. Because also I wanted to take a quick look at this. Because, oh, hope he smokes. lighter stone or something down there that must be like a ravine slash rift slash lava slash something and hope he smokes and then this of course oh hi oh great skellington all right i guess i should have guessed should have figured I don't like all these scary noises. I mean, that is incredible and awesome to look at. So, hey, little guy. Do I have my... Okay, I got the bed. Who cares if my spawn point changes? I'm... I don't know where I'm going. I don't want to head back into it, and I was headed back into it. And by into it, I just mean back to, like back toward my home and I'm still trying to find a I think number one a village and number two just a good place to make something but uh, but then there's this to look at oh hope he's some mopes this is awesome though scary but awesome and even more good lord okay I got distracted from what I was doing again <laughs> I wonder how that happened I mean look at this we gotta look at it I mean look at this Thank you for having watched the first part of this two-part episode of Minecraft, Large Biomes. Oh my gosh, what a world. How crazy. It's wonderful and I enjoy it so very, very much. Now I know the action cuts off abruptly because it cuts off abruptly, but when it cuts off abruptly, it doesn't cut off abruptly because part two is coming out tomorrow. Thumbs up for that. So you take care. Have a great day today. I will see you on the flip side, and that is a definite thumbs up.